I'm Jack from Jack TV Stuff, and today we have kombucha from D Kombucha Bar. It's actually a D. Kombucha lovers, in a world full of soda, be a kombucha. Drinking soda and all those sugar packed drinks are so yesterday. Let us be health conscious and be watchful with what we put in our body. Let us be health conscious and be watchful with what we put into our body. So join me in my pledge to be healthy. Drink kombucha and stay healthy. Subscribe! We have four flavors here. We have ginger. Which is meant to be tangy. Then we have passion fruit. Then we have passion fruit. That's meant to be sour. Then we have pineapple, which is sweet sour. I'm hoping it's more sweet than sour. And we have apple, which is sweet. I'm going to start with the passion fruit because passion. And kombucha is fermented tea. Think about those health vinegars that you have in the mall. When you walk in the mall and then these guys give you a sample of like some vinegar. It's something like that, but it's not quite like that. It's actually better because it's not vinegar lah. I'm a gao boja choy. So this is actually tea, but it's fermented. And it's slightly alcoholic and it's supposed to become more alcoholic as it ages. When I say slightly alcoholic, I mean half a percent. So basically I could drink all four of these and it will still be less than a, a pint of beer. But this is more for the health, not to get drunk. The alcohol is the bonus. Passion fruit, hey, ginger. I, I think I just pour them all. Ginger. Passion fruit. I know what you're thinking. You're thinking these are all the same color. Jack is definitely gonna mix them up. No, because they smell and taste different. However, if you do watch my Gardenia review, I do get confused because Gardenia and Marty White, they taste pretty much the same. And finally, the apple. Kombucha, be healthy, stay healthy. Subscribe. The color. tea kind of colour. It actually, it has some alcohol smell. I remember in France when the grape juice is less than a month old, the, the colour is similar to this and it's slightly bubbly. Uh, for extra reference, we keep the, the juice or the wine for one year before we put it into bottles. Mm. Oh, that's just strong. What is this? Passion fruit. Oh yeah, passion fruit is supposed to be sour. Definitely sour. For those of you who like sour, this is for you. Woo! What's the next one? Oh wait, that was the ginger, sorry. Yeah, that's tangy. Yeah, tangy, soury tangy. What's this? The next one is passion fruit. This is supposed to be sour. Less tangy, but more passion fruit. I mean, more sour. Okay, there is definitely less tang here. 
and it's still sour. I kind of prefer this one because I'm not a tangy guy. What's the next one? Pineapple, sweet sour, okay. So we, we start from tangy, sour, sweet sour, and finally we will have sweet at the end for apple. Some good nose there. It basically smells like the fruit, but slightly fermented. And fermented in the, the kind of, I suppose the French way where they ferment wine and eau de vie, which is spirits. Not in the same way that they ferment like the smelly tofu and vinegar. It definitely has a, it has a positively nice fermentation smell. Yeah, okay. I can taste the sweet here, and it's definitely less sour. It's not tangy at all, but that, that this tangy, that's got a kick. If you like tangy, go for the ginger. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, you are getting progressively less sour. Yeah. I'm a sweet guy, I like sweet things. Yeah, finally, the apple. Apple, I'm very optimistic. Mm, okay, I like this one. I'm not gonna say, oh, this is good. No, because these are all good. It's just they taste differently. This is more to my taste. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> if I get more of these, I'll definitely be buying more apple and um, not the other three because tangy sour is not my type. But lots of people love sour stuff and tangy stuff. I hear for girls, they, they, girls tell me that sour and bitter is good for them, like Guinness style is sour and bitter and it's good for them as well. So I guess if you're a girl, buy something that's sour and tangy. If you're a guy or drinking, you know, like uh, girlfriend, boyfriend sharing, get the sweet one, apple. Pretty good. Refreshing drink in the afternoon. Yep, passion fruit sour. Mmm, ginger tang. Wow, it's tangy. Woo! Wow, if you like tangy, ginger's for you. Wow. You know the kind where I can't keep your eyes open? What's this? Oh yeah, the passion fruit. Uh, no tang, but it's full sour. Then what's this? Pineapple. Okay, less sour, getting more sweet. And apple, I'll finish there already. Apple some more, don't worry. Ooh. It's pretty good actually. Kombucha! Kombucha! Where can these be found? I'll put links in the description and I hear this is going to be sold in a, in a chain store soon. Subscribe and keep updated. Oh yeah, like their Facebook page. Mm, yeah, this apple is sweet. I like this. For those of you who don't like sour, go for the apple. This is the Penang brand. Uh, my my friend's family makes it. <laughs> oh. I, I felt like having a nap, but now I feel I feel more energized. I don't know. I still might have a nap. See how. Subscribe and kombucha. All details will be in the description.